I am going to produce electricity using this magnet and we are starting right now. I have this galvanometer in my hand. It is used to detect the presence of current. And as you can see, I have connected this coil with this galvanometer. If you see any deflection in the needle, that means there is some current. Let's try to deflect this needle with the help of this magnet. Here we go. Yes, I am producing electricity with the help of this magnet. And if I move this coil like this instead of the magnet, then also this needle is deflecting. And when I rotate this magnet inside the coil or rotate the coil around the magnet, then the needle is deflecting again. Right, and I am producing electricity with the help of this magnet. Oh my god! Moving on to experiment number two, let's see if I can make this LED glow with the help of a magnet. I don't think you have the facilities for that big man. So I have connected this LED with a coil of 6000 turns and I am going to move this magnet through this coil. And yes, the LED is glowing. How? Hold on bro. How? Let me switch off the lights and move this magnet through this coil. Can you see this? The LED is glowing. Okay. Ah! And here is my third and last experiment. I am going to open this DC motor. Let's find out what is there inside this DC motor. You can see a set of coils and two magnets on either side. And when I am rotating this shaft, coils are rotating between the magnets, which is going to generate electricity. Can you see how this bulb is glowing right now using a DC motor? And how this torch is lighting up using a DC motor? And here is a bonus learning for you. I am rotating a set of coils between the magnets inside the DC motor here with the help of this handle. Similarly, in wind mills, the wind rotates the blades. Or in water turbines, the water rotates the turbine. And the rotating blades and turbines are directly connected to DC motors to produce the electricity that we use in our homes. With this, we have come to the end of this video. Let me ask you one question. Can a coil Behave like a magnet. We pass some electricity through the coil. If you don't know the answer of this question, click on this video to know more about this. We'll dive deep into this concept. So click on this video and I'll see you there.